didn't you do? You told me. Ha! Submarine we talked about. You gotta help me store it for a few days. Floyd, don't go quiet on me or I'll come around and, and I'll, well, we both know what I'm talking about. Okay, um, all right. D -d Bring it around to Pier 400 at the Western Docks. On my way. Look, uh, I'll have a truck to bring you around the warehouse. What's this? The Union man doing an honest day's work? There's nothing honest about this, sir. But this is a dishonest day's work, if ever I've seen one. Hey, we're not hurting anyone. No, but no one except whoever owns that submarine and the, and the mercenary folks on the freighter. Do some research on Meriwether Security Consulting, friend. They'd be on trial for human rights offenses if the U.S. government didn't protect all its contractors from any kind of suit, military or civilian. They're immune from prosecution, and they behave like they are. Murdering, stealing, high on power guns and anabolic steroids. <sighs> Lucky bastards. Look, I don't know about that stuff. Oh. You're right. You don't. Merryweather are employed by the richest, greediest scum on the planet to shit on the poorest and the neediest. So we are going to enjoy shitting on them. Oh, great. I look forward to that. Okay. That's more like it. You there? Uh, yes, sir. I'm on the crane. The surface, and I'll bring you shoreside. All right.
I'm here. Oh, hmm. It's just down the road. Los Santos Marine, past the shipyards. Is that sub covered properly? It'll be fine if we just get there. Are you being short with me? No, 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 sir. I, I'm certainly not being short. I'm just not used to this kind of pressure. If you turn a crew onto a score, you gotta be ready for the heat that comes with it. I didn't turn anyone on to anything. You threatened and cajoled and tricked me. You don't want to cut? Just walk away. I can't walk away. You're robbing my workplace and running the show from my home. Deborah's home. No cut for you, no cut for Deborah. You can pull up. Okay there. Um, sure. All right. If you're wrong, I'll eat your sweet meats. Now get out of here. A T, baby. I'm just trying to tell you I care about you. You care about yourself. I need someone real in my life. We wasted years on this bullshit and you still the same. I want a family. I need some security in my life. Goodbye, Frank. Yeah. 
day. I took off like air day. Put that shit in these haters' faces. I get money like air day. I'm drinking on that mean perk. Blaze make the street hurt. Make a bitch die. What's up, man? Sit down and face forward. Now, I don't have a lot of time. I know you need money. Did Michael tell you about Life Invader? Oh, shit. Y'all two did that? Look forward. We're two strangers having a friendly chat. And don't pretend that you liked Jane Norris. Oh, man, I don't know, homie. I mean, yeah, the dude I source worked to child slaves. Then stole and sold everybody's private information. And even ripped his own friend's ideas off and walked around like the Messiah while doing it, but... Man, I don't think the nigga deserved to have his fucking head blowed off on TV. Oh, well, aren't you just a moral majority? You know, that's why the world is the way it is today, when a paid thug gets all namby-pamby when someone asks him to act like a paid thug and for a good cause. Man, check this out, homie. I like blowing motherfucking fools' heads off just as much as the next psychotic asshole. But I just don't look at the shit as doing a good deed. Well, now you can, because it's not fools' heads, it's assholes' heads. And not just heads, you know, trashing cars or planting lies, forging evidence, anything we can do to take the battle back to these turds. You know, we'll fix the market in our favor and we'll right a few wrongs while we're at it. <laughs> Shit, okay, cool. Right, so, you heard of Mollus? Hell yeah. Okay, so there's a new Mollus, sort of a super Mollus, and it's called Priapolds. It's giving the living rigor mortis. Only Brett Lowry, CEO of Bilkington Research, paid off the FDA. And he doesn't care that his hardness pills are giving desperate middle-aged men the world over heart 